Hey guys, welcome back to this tutorial on which I will show you guys the process of getting the new Frontier mod pack. Uh, if you guys don't already know this, it is available on the Twitch desktop app. And this is basically Twi uh, the Curse launcher. Now, Curse has uh, kind of combined with Twitch. So if there is any confusion, please let me know in the description below in the comment section. But uh, this is where you're going to be finding this mod pack in Twitch. Uh, this right here. And as you can see, it has all these tabs. And I will go through that later for you guys. So as you can see, these are all the mod packs that I've already downloaded. And before all that, I will show you guys how to install Twitch. And this, it might be confusing because it's not really the streaming Twitch. But it also kind of is. And um, once you guys get it, you will understand better than I do. But yeah, you basically search the Twitch, uh, I can't even spell, Twitch desktop app uh, right here. And it should be under apps.twitch.tv. Uh, I don't know why they did this, but it really won't make a difference for you guys just because it is the same thing. You guys have an account and you could actually connect it to your Steam, your Curse, or your uh, already made um, Twitch account. So yeah, you can launch in browser, which I haven't tried, but I would just recommend to download it. Now, downloading shouldn't be too hard. This is a very user-friendly uh, program, software. You guys download it, open it up. I would recommend saving it to your uh, task taskbar uh, and stuff like that. And you open it. So basically, it starts off with nothing because you guys do have to log in but once you do create an account you can add your friends uh as you can see i have my own account uh many people have already uh followed it you guys could too i'm all right with that it's dan soccer 254 um another cool thing is through this and curse you could make your own mod packs now i have already made my own mod pack it's called wondercraft and i hope you guys check it out and I hope you guys like it. So please go do that. And now to the mod pack that we've been looking for. So as you can see, uh, you go back. This should be empty because this is uh, basically a list of all the mod packs that I've already downloaded and installed. Um, but you can go through Browse uh, Feed the Beast mod packs. You can create your own mods, mod packs basically. And it'll look like this. Or you can browse all the mod packs. And it's kind of in different orders. You can switch the orders by feature, popularity, last updated. So you can see like all the, some new mod packs that people make on their own. Uh, you know, but they're not as good as my wonder crap, but you know, whatever. So I'll go through popularity uh, and it's right here, the new frontier. But if you can't find it, I recommend just searching the new frontier and bam, it's right there. You guys will not have too much of a hard time. It is popping, everyone likes it. And um, basically, all you do is press install. Over here, they have a list of all the mods they use in it. Uh, catalog is basically a description of the most recent uh, update. And then there's different versions. Uh, other than that, you guys press install and it will appear in your Minecraft tab and you press play. Now, another thing is uh, you can only have this Minecraft tab if and only if you have the actual Minecraft. So no cracked version and no fake, nothing. You guys need the actual Minecraft you pay for, for it to be showed up. Well, you also need, you need to download it on your computer for it to show up right here because these actually open up through uh, your uh, real account. Uh, it opens up, it launch, launches the launcher and you press play. So that is that. Uh, um, other than that, I hope you guys go install the new frontier. Um, you install my mod pack, which is Wondercraft, and you enjoy those. I'm sorry for the plug, but you know I got it. And other than that, please go support uh, this the maker of the mod pack. And I hope this teaches you how to uh, use the Twitch desktop app for you guys to go and get whatever mod packs you guys like. And really, this is all you need to watch. And after that, you guys 
won't have too much trouble playing all the Minecraft mod packs you want. And also a reminder, a lot of these are big mod packs, so you do need strong computers. Uh, laptops usually can't run much, but I remember when I had a laptop, I could run some of the lighter mod packs. A lot of mod packs even have light versions, so you guys can go check that out. Uh, I hope this tutorial was useful enough, and I hope you guys don't have too much problem with Twitch. So other than that, uh, that's it for me. I hope you guys like and subscribe. Let me know in the comment section below what you thought, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.